So today we're welcoming another new business owner, Kelly Cincinelli, who opened up Calla Lily's Boutique at 34 North Main Street in Gloversville. Just getting an idea as to what it was like to open up and the idea behind her business. So let's go. For those who are hesitant to open up a business in Gloversville, I take, I'd say take a second look. Start talking to people um, in the area, uh, either businesses that have been here for a while or new businesses, and what you'll start to see is this is a town that's on its way up. It's on its way into a huge growth spurt, and what better time to become a part of something than when it's on its way up. Um, and I, I really think that this town has a lot to offer, has a lot to offer the people in the town and people outside of the town. And that's the idea, is to pull people in and make them love it. So the idea behind Cal Lilies is that it is a pre-loved um, or pre-owned uh, bridal, prom, vintage wear shop. So the idea is that any woman, despite her budget, should feel like a princess for any special event that she has going on, whether it be prom or a wedding. Um, so what we do here is we take gowns that were either you know, gently used or some of them are brand new, um, buy them at an affordable price, and then we customize them or upcycle them for the client so that they're getting a one-of-a-kind gown for the price of a secondhand dress. If you look at statistically how many uh, clothing items get thrown away on a yearly basis, they're just sitting in a landfill, right? Most um, special gowns, unless they're super, super expensive, are made of polyester or other um, man-made materials. Those materials do not disintegrate in the earth, they just sit there and collect. So the idea is to reuse, recycle, upcycle, um, taking something old, making it new again, um, making it interesting again, and reusing it. I've been into fashion my whole life. It's, it's one of my creative outlets. I feel that expressing yourself through your clothing is a huge thing. Um, I love to look different, unique, and I love to shop at secondhand stores. 99% um, of my wardrobe comes from secondhand stores, and then I change it, or modify it, mix it with new things. Um, and I've always loved that, and so I'm trying to carry that through to other women. Um, I also love glamour. I do makeup. Um, all of that stuff kind of falls in line with what I'm doing. I grew up originally on the Canadian border way up north in Messina and I spent a lot of my adult life uh, down in uh, Dutchess and Orange County which is close to New York City. So I've, And I've been in the Rochester area for a minute too so I've kind of seen all of New York State. Um, but I love it here because you get the best of both worlds. You have green mountains, you know, uh, beautiful water, all of that great stuff that nature has to offer, but there's also a, a city element that still is, is in this area. So it's, um, it's a great place to be, and, and, I, and I, I love that I settled here. My opening date is September 17th. Uh, we will be doing both, or not both, I should say, all three sales consignment and rentals so um, you could come in and buy a gown outright uh, you can bring your old um, items or I shouldn't say old but your used items in and um, we can consign them for you so we can sell them and then you get a percentage back that you can either use in the store or you know take the cash away with you um, and we're also going to do rentals so the idea is to kind of cater to everybody so say you found a gown that you absolutely adore but maybe you can't afford it you could rent it for the occasion. Right. 